Hi everyone, it's Manzel here, and I hope everyone's having an awesome day, and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at Cedar Wood, daughter of Pinocchio, and this is from the Sugar Coated line. I also picked her up from Toots Toys, and I'll leave a link to their website in the description down below. Before we check out Cedar, we'll first take a look at the beautiful packaging that she comes in. Right, so we'll start off by taking a look in the top left hand corner, and here we have the Rebel Seal done in gold. Just below that we have a picture of Cedar holding a cake in this beautiful gold frame. And going up the side of the box in gold lettering, it says Cedarwood, daughter of Pinocchio. In the top right hand corner we have the sugar coated logo, and this is a little gingerbread man holding a 3 tiered cake with a little lolly on the top. And in the bottom right hand corner we have the Ever After High logo, which is in the shape of a heart shaped locket, and we also have a little key. And this doll is also recommended for ages 6 and up. On the side of the box it's been made to look like a spine of a book, and we have this little pendant here which has been used as a bookmark. And again just under that it says Ever After High on a pink background. And again on the side of the box it says Cedarwood, daughter of Pinocchio. On the back of the box it says choose your own Ever After. It's time for the full bake sale at Ever After High, and the students have a lot on their plates preparing their very favourite recipes. Each charming treat is royally spellalicious, but which one will really take the cake? Just under that we have a recipe for the sticky sweet truth cake. And the recipe includes 1 cup not truly all purpose flour, 1 cup of slippery elm sap, 2 logs of butter balm, 3.5 strips of enchanted forest peppermint bark, 1 tablespoon of clove seedlings, 2 cinnamon sticks, 2 teaspoons of coffee to full salt, 4 authentic nest eggs, half a cup of genuine maple sapling syrup, and 1 dash of real branch water. And under that it says, OK I can't lie, the recipe actually says to use one cinnamon stick and two teaspoons of pumpkin spice, but I wanted to go out on a limb and make the cake my very own, and hey it honestly turned out to be spellalicious, but if it's ingrained in you to follow a recipe from root to leaf, that's excellent, but I'm stumped as to why anyone would pass up a chance to chip in some creativity. And in the bottom left hand corner we have pictures of Gingerbread House, and I've just recently reviewed her sugar coated playset, so go check that out, and I'll leave a link to that at the end of the video. And also we have Madeline Hatter, and Holly O'Hare. And going down the right hand side of the box we have some more artwork of Cedar, and she's getting ready to prepare her sticky sweet truth cake. So that was a look at the packaging, I'm going to go ahead now and take Cedar out of the box and we can check her out up close. And here is Cedar out of the box, and before I go ahead and review her, I just wanted to show you the new toffee apple flavour from M&M's. And here is what the packet looks like up close, and I really love the colours of the packaging, which is done in pink and yellow and green. And we also have our M&M's there, which are done in green, pink and red. And it says new toffee apple flavour, and these come in a 200 gram bag. And this is a view from the back, and we have Miss Green there, and she says, as the brains of the outfit, it's my job to answer all your M&M questions, anything I can help you with, just give us a call on, and it has the two phone numbers, and I think the first one is Australia, and the second one is definitely New Zealand. Right, so let's pull them out of the bag and see what they're like. And here they are out of the bag, and they look like three different colours of apples. So I've just given these a taste test, and they're actually really good, I like them a lot. 
Right, so that was just a quick look at the m and so I'm going to put these to the side now and we will check out Cedar. So we'll start off by taking a look at her hair, which is done in a light and dark brown. It's also parted in the middle and it's curly at the ends. And I'll just give you a view of that from the back. And here is a look at her hair from the back and it's really soft to touch. She's also wearing a braided headband, which is done in baby blue. And on the left hand side we have this little bow, and it even has pink icing on the top. Moving down to her makeup, her eyeshadow is done in silver, brown, pink and yellow. And she's wearing pink lipstick with a little red heart shape in the middle. Her outfit is really cute, and the top half of her dress is done in white, and it has a brown wood grain design on it. And it also has these puffy sleeves. The bottom half of her dress is done in a coral pink with these black pinstripes. And over the top she has this really cute apron which has a waffle cone design on it, as well as blue icing and sprinkles. On the right hand side of her apron she has a printed pocket with blue icing, and it has all her cooking utensils in it. Over the top of her dress she has this purple collar which attaches around her neck, and it has a little bow and these little blue buttons going down the side. And I'll just give you a view of how that attaches from the back. She also has this really tasty belt which is done in brown and pink icing and is also dripping down the sides. And the suspenders attached to her belt have a pink wafer design on them. Her shoes are also really cute and they are done in baby blue and the straps at the top look like dripping icing. And I'll just give you a view of those up close. And on the toe of her shoes they're decorated with sprinkles. And check out her wedge style heels, they have a waffle cone pattern on them. And I'll just give you a view of those from the back. Cedar also comes with a couple of accessories, including this blue spatula, which has a wood green pattern on it. And this two tiered cake done in brown and blue icing. The brown icing has a wood grain pattern in it, and it also has little leaves scattered around. And we also have a little bird. And the Ever After High logo on it as well. On each side there are two little handles on the cake tray where Cedar can hold it. And just for a bit of fun, you could place the cake over her bow, so she can wear it as a hat. The other accessories that come included is this gold hairbrush in the shape of a key. And this translucent white doll stand with a gold base with the Ever After High logo embossed on it. Ok guys, that comes the end of my review for Cedar Wood from the sugar coated line from Ever After High and all her accessories, as well as a look at the new toffee apple flavour from M&M's. Comment below and let me know what you think, and until next time, thank you again for watching, love you guys, and I look forward to seeing you same place, same time, tomorrow.